Mark Rogers TV looking at the Yankees pitching rotation for 2011. The most unstable it's been coming out of spring training during the Yankees championship era going back to 1995. In the first three positions, we've got the sure thing, the probability, and the wild card. The sure thing, of course, being Mr. CC Sabathia. 31 years old. He's in his prime. He won 21 last year. 40 and 15 as a Yankee in two seasons. And most of all, he's a workhorse. He's pitched more innings than any pitcher in the big leagues in the past four seasons. Again, pitching a very uncertain commodity, but this is just about as sure thing as there is in the bigs. CC Sabathia as the ace for the Yankees. In the number two spot, Yankee fans would like to think it's a certainty that Phil Hughes will win 17 to 19 games, but not necessarily. He's only got one full season under his belt as a starting pitcher. Going back to 2009, the final nine starts of that season, Hughes has pitched well for the most part, looks good, looks solid, but again, it's just been one season, and he got rocked in two starts in the ALCS against the Texas Rangers. The third position, way up in the air with A.J. Burnett. We think of this guy as having unlimited potential, a dynamic arm, an emerging superstar, but A.J. Burnett now 34 years old, and he is what he is. He's great one start. He's lousy for two starts. He's great again for three starts. He's back and forth, up and down. He's dynamite. He's horrible. He had a five-plus ERA last year, and really, again, A.J. Burnett is not a great pitcher and never will be. He's never logged to less than four ERA, and really, he's losing his dominance. For the first time in his career last season, he gave up more hits than innings pitched. Now come the cast of thousands. The Yankees aren't going to come up with two starting pitchers to fill spots four and five. Most likely, this is going to be a mix-and-match, patch-it-up scenario for manager Joe Girardi throughout the summer and fall. Yvonne Nova's 24. He had seven starts last year. Pitched marginal, but he's maturing. He's got a good breaking ball. Yvonne Nova should fill that four position for the Yankees. Sergio Mitre, he's 30 years old. He's going to be given a shot, but why should he be any better than he's been for the past six or seven years in the big leagues? 64 career starts, and he's got a 527 ERA. Sergio Mitre needs to be a five starter for the Yankees at best. Now we've got the two pitchers with track records, but with aging arms. Bartolo Colon's 38, didn't even pitch in the big leagues in 2010, hasn't really pitched well at all. Let's be truthful about it. He's been horrible since 2005, 14 wins, 21 losses in the bigs, and a 5-plus ERA, and he doesn't have the big arm anymore. He's got all the weight. He's not going to make it through a full season if they get five to eight to ten good starts out of Bartolo Colon, that would be a miracle. I'm going to write off Bartolo Colon for the Yankees in 2011. Freddy Garcia, I give a lot more credence in this selection, inviting him to spring training. Garcia had three awful seasons in 07, 8, and 9, but he bounced back last year. Pitched well with the White Sox, 12 and 6 with a 4.5 ERA. What uh, is the telling tale for Freddy Garcia is the fastball. He's not going to throw 95 like he did in his prime with the Mariners, but he usually gets it up to about 88 miles per hour on his good days. He got rocked last season when he could only throw 83 or 84. Freddy Garcia is a viable candidate for one of those two starting positions for the Yankees. Then past that, I think, again, we're going to, be encountering some names we haven't heard of yet as the Yankees look around the bigs, look around the minors for some guys both young and old who can help out. Yankee fans, I would love to hear from you on your prospects in the pitching department in 2011. I'm Mark Rogers, TV.